We get a lot of questions about our E3 Faraday backpack, so I wanted to run you guys through a couple things. The entire bag is not Faraday, so let me show you what is. In this pack, there's two removable Faraday sleeves, one for your phone and the other for your laptop. Both of these are secured with Fidlock magnets, so you can take either one of these out and use them standalone or leave them in your pack for ease. It's worth mentioning, the device has to be below these ridges and the sleeve has to be shut because if the sleeve is not shut and sealed, it won't be able to do its job efficiently. But regardless, your phone or your laptop, grab it, open it up, slide your device in, shut it, seal it, close it, and then you can't be hacked, tracked, or located. That's when your device goes off the grid. So starting from the front zippered compartment, there's two big mesh slip pockets that go all the way down to the bottom, and there's two zippered compartments and a D-ring in case you wanna hook your keys or something else too. The middle zippered compartment comes standard with a packing cube. However, I normally carry one of our E3 crossbodies so I can use it as a tech organizer or to slim down from carrying a big backpack. The second zippered compartment is where most of your storage can go. It's pretty much wide open and there's a zip mesh pocket up here at the top. And in the back where your laptop goes, there's still a little bit more storage in here. So all the major compartments aside, there is smaller zippered compartments everywhere on this bag. So going back to the front, there's two pockets right here. Again, these are not Faraday. The only Faraday material in the entire bag is in the phone and laptop sleeve. On the side, water bottle holder. Come here to the back. This little pocket right here on the shoulder strap has honestly become one of my favorite spots to carry an extra blade or my AirPods. Back here, this is RFID blocking, as you can tell by the RFID tag. This is where you put your passport, your wallet, pretty much any other essentials you wanna keep close to body. Chest strap secured with Fidlock magnets. And then lastly, there's a luggage pass through so you can take this and slide it over your luggage. We love this backpack and I know a lot of you do as well. So hopefully this gives you a little bit better of an understanding of what this pack can and cannot do. But if you still got questions, drop them in the comments below.